coming out of his mouth. Seems like he's burned a lot of energy. That looked like a tired serve. Mm -hmm. Let's see. Short second serve. Oh, you just wow. and Rodriguez just dumped that forehand into the into the middle of the net. I mean, I sound redundant, like I love cross court shots, but there's no reason to go down. I mean, it's thirty all state state points. Match point. Heading to serve for a decisive two nothing lead for South Africa. There, it is. there you go. Look, and look he at does the it. South African bench. Philip Henning pulls out the win. 6-4, six, 6-4. Four, six, four. That was a great effort from the South African team today. Um, you know, they obviously easily could have taken their foot off the gas, and instead he cranked it up. Kids got a million dollar smile. Look at him. He, he's jacked yeah, up. Yeah, they're right? pumped up. It, these guys are really excited. You really kind of get the feel for the seriousness of the event. Um, so is that some of that Lloyd Harris yeah. momentum building on the younger players? The coaching. Yeah, I mean, that's a good point. Uh, coaches shaking hands or pounding fists, rather. Uh, exchanging some uh, nice words. And... Lloyd Harris and the South African team is, uh, they're happy. They're feeling good. So that's kind of a trickle down confidence. I, I mean, there's talent there. Don't get me wrong. There's talents, but, but uh, you, you can see it here in, in their discipline, their shot making. And uh, I mean, Hinnon's pretty jacked up. I, I was talking to Raven a little bit later. I was asking him, hey, is he going to outlast Tom Brady? I mean, he's 39, still playing pro tennis. Seems to be a trend in tennis to uh, why not keep playing? Yeah, I think that as long as these guys are fit and they're competing, 